Good day, Trina Christine Mason here. I'm about to start playing my harp that is very clearly out of tune. And I like to practice this meditation attempting to find my own tune and rhythm with an instrument that I know clearly is out of tune. So here we go, Let's see what I can get to step through. And I'll tune her later, I promise. Adjusting some strings here. And like even then my that guy sounds like really bad. <laughs> Not my favorite key right now. Even this guy's messed up. A lot of my a lot of my higher keys are really, really, really out of harmony. <laughs> and some of these sounds, if you notice and pay attention, they actually you can feel how they cause you disharmony. If you actually pay attention to how they make you feel the notes, the way they make you shift your vibe, right? Your attention, your feelings inside. If you pay attention, you can actually catch it and notice. struggling to find my own song today. Especially <laughs> with these harmonics. <laughs> like, mm, I don't even think I have the tool. The tool isn't even in here. <laughs> it's a lot harder to tune a harp, if you ask me. I feel like those tunes are necessary too. You know, you can't just like, neglect the bad sounds and the bad vibrations you feel. You gotta acknowledge them and let your truth ring. <laughs> right? No one wants to hear anybody else's sad song. But if you pay attention, you'll see the language people speak with the music of their being, the way they express themselves. And that can be through either the tone of voice, you know, maybe they say something in a certain tone, and maybe that they're saying another word, but you can hear in that particular tone that they feel or exist a certain way that they may not express verbally, but you can feel and notice when you pay attention. Same thing with the music notes. hands I need to relax <laughs> I'm like, I need to 
the key that goes good with that one. I haven't found it yet. <laughs> Here we go. This is kind of doable. It's not like... There you go. Add the third key. other keys I don't want them to hit so I'm trying to learn how to be with the instrument and how to express my fingers in the way that I want my noise my music my being to sound so I have to like play with myself right and literally learn the motor skills and the forms of expression so that this part of me can come out on quote stage or express itself right so you have to kind of create the space so that can step through Kind of hard not to play a broken hearted song with a broken heart, right? Out of tune. <laughs> hmm. I don't like that key unless I mix it with the other one. Let me try to find the other key again.
Right, y'all, even I'm starting to get a little bit, like, disharmonic from even playing with this thing. I'm like, I might have to just break down and tune her up. So the keys sound great, but the higher keys, like, they're not, not fully singing the song I want to hear. <laughs> Yeah, all the hard keys. All I got. Like everything's the same right after here. But it does not sound good. Here? It's my last um, E chord, it looks like. Yeah. Alright, so let's just play with these.